the little intro. So this is a uh, Smith & Wesson 625 Jerry Micklick edition. So it's a 4 inch end frame 45 ACP with a nice gold bead dot on the front. I am partial to those for sure. So this one does have a, a slightly lightened spring kit in it. So the trigger spring is uh, 14 pounds. Hmm. And it uses moon clips. That's and the, it uses moon clips. The deal with these 625s. Yeah, that's pretty easy loading, that's for sure. I mean, right now. The other part happens, I guess, watching TV. <laughs> All right, same target um, on the left, double action. I think you'll be happy with the group. All right, go see. Yeah, that is really sweet. There's something about those Micklick grips too that I think I like, and uh, maybe we'll commit to doing on my other ones. I, I mentioned, saw a video where he was saying about all of the different frame sizes use the exact same contour, so you have consistency with each of the different styles that you use as grips for. And they just seem extremely thin, but it wasn't abusive at all. I mean, partly because it's an ACP, but you know, for a big gun, it didn't, it wasn't uh, hard to shoot. Okay, yeah, two in the same hole there. Yeah, if you ignore those couple, the alignment definitely was right on. Yeah, that's an easy one to shoot. I wish you wouldn't have brought that one out. <laughs> so what led you into the moon clip thing? It just seems like that's complexity. Competition. So uh, I bought this for IDPA shooting. And uh, I used it for a couple of seasons. Huh. And do you find a lot of those out there in competition? Uh, we had a couple hundred people in our club, and uh, there were three of us that had the revolvers. So it's not, not extremely popular. No, it seems like that's the purest approach <laughs> when you can go back to the old school wheel gun. It's a lot more fun. A lot more fun, yeah. Well, and the ACP tames that down, too, even though it's a large frame. Yeah. That's pretty, pretty mild shooting. Giant no, hole agree. without a lot of recoil. Yeah. All right, let's see you do it. You know what's funny is I got a profile view like that with the 38 special when we were shooting that uh, model 13 yeah and the recoil is about the same is it you know, when you look at the muzzle flip in it it was surprising <laughs> all right well that's still offhand though and that's a pretty decent distance so you got one in the right ribs and one in the pelvis a lot of people will tell you that's a great shot and then ventilated new new uh aortas and a throat shot yeah, you always have to have a throat shot. I think maybe that's like a thyroid shot. <laughs> they have a problem with their thyroid. Lead poisoning. Yeah, they definitely have a problem with it now. <laughs> 